Hello everyone. So have you ever tried building even a slightly complex application using AI tools like Replit, Claude or Cursor only to find yourself stuck in an endless loop of prompts and clarifications? So the problem is these tools need more than just a vague idea which you view as a prompt, like create an app which can generate image through just a text. They need a detailed plan, a blueprint. That's why we created Create's MVP app, the world's first open source project requirement document creator, specifically designed to give AI the structured information it needs to build your app. So what's a PRD? It's essentially the detailed specification for your project. Instead of asking AI to guess, you give it these documents and it understands exactly what you want. So let me show you how it works. Let's say I want to build a simple application. So let me go here and create MVP plan. So let me just say like uh, uh, generate, a, generate an app which can uh, convert like markdown text into HTML. So normally you might type a prompt like this into your coding tool and it would struggle to know where to start, what technologies to use, how the front end connects to the backend, etc. But here is our create MVP start a app. I will type my idea like generate an MVP uh, which can convert markdown text into HTML. So now watch this. When I hit generate create MVP start app doesn't try to write the code directly. Instead, it focus on creating the plan. You will see it goes through several steps, analyzing the request and structuring the information. It's creating typically seven to eight crucial documents in the background, shows you the progress as mentioned uh, here. Uh, then these documents are your project blueprint. This includes things like the core project requirement document, defining features, uh, technical requirement documents, specifying text stack and architecture, detailed front end and back end implementation plans, the user flow diagram showing how someone uses the app, and a breakdown of the technology stack needed, uh, as shown here. So, okay, it says the implementation plan is generated, uh, as you can see here, and the files are ready, as you can see here. So, plan six, or plan five, I guess, yeah. So they are downloaded as zip files. So instead of just getting a vague idea or incomplete code, we now have a complete structured set of documents detailing exactly how to build that markdown to HTML converter. So, so there are different different files, right? So before we use these files, just a quick note on create MVP store app itself. It's completely open source, uh, as I showed here, right? Uh, available on GitHub. You can find the code. You can try it for free. Like, like and you can set it up locally. We also have affordable plans. Like uh, it is just a five dollar currently with the uh, uh, free access code for like early access users. All right, uh, we have seven documents, right? Now, the let's see how these documents uh, using your favorite AI coding tool. Uh, so let me show you uh, for this demo. I'm going to let me add the instructions here. Yeah, cursor. These documents provided all the necessary con context, right? So let's take these seven files uh, as we have here. And uh, we have this folder, uh, the seven documents, backend, flow, frontend, PRD, requirements, status, text stack, cursor rules, right? So everything is here. So I have put it in new folder, as you can see here. Now I'm... Uh, Cursor file explorer shows all the documents as seen here. So normally asking an AI coding tool to build a markdown to HTML converter would be too vague, right? But now we have to the full blueprint. I'm going to give Cursor a prompt telling it to use these documents. My goal is to get it to set up the initial project structure and maybe even write some core code based on the plan. So I will just type something like uh, based on the product provided project requirement documentation, technical requirement document, and all of this document. Create an initial project structure for this app and uh, let's see. Let me use thinking model 3.7 on it or 2.5 pro both i like it so let me see what it does right so as you can see uh, it is saying i am setting up initial project structure for your markdown to html and then it is going through different different documents look at that right <laughs> cursor is now setting up the project folder structure adding configuration files and even starting to write some initial core snippets all guided by our prd documents created by our application right so from just one prompt in create MVP start app, we got a full detailed plan. And by giving that plan, Cursor, we can now tell Cursor to kickstart the entire project setup and initial development steps based on the detailed plan, essentially getting a significant head start in one go for this phase, right? So from here, uh, you can see subsequent prompts you can give, always refer to documents. And uh, every time you can say like, yeah, based on the front end implementation documentation and the user flow diagram, build the main input and output components in the user interface, the documents continue to guide Cursor every step of the way, right? So this is the power of combining create MVP store app. I am really excited how you will use it. You can use it with all of the tools available, uh, which converts like idea to app kind of thing. So you go from idea to fully planned project, and then you can use it to uh, your uh, any apps, uh, AI needs to build what you actually want, right? So yeah, you can just continue. I will, I will share the final output for you. So thank you.